Am I the asshole? For refusing to help my sister throw a party and pay for a gift for our parents' 30th wedding anniversary? My sister has acknowledged that she's aware of this stuff. But she still wanted me to help her throw a party for their anniversary and to go half with her on this really expensive gift she wants to get them. She told me about it over Christmas. The anniversary is in April. She wanted to go all out but I told her I'm not doing anything that big to celebrate them and will not be putting all that effort in when they never make it with me. She told me that this would be helping her too. I told her she wants me to help her celebrate the people who show clear favoritism between their kids. She doesn't see the big deal. We argued. She told me I was being childish and that I'm unfair to her them. She told me if I don't help with the party and the gift I am publicly shaming our parents and leaving it all on her shoulders at all. Am I the asshole? Not the asshole. Give them makeup and dolls. Not the asshole favoritism or not you don't have an obligation to pay expensive gifts to your parents or to throw big parties. It is nice if you can afford it and if you have a good relationship with them, but not a given. Your sister calling you unfair when it was your parents showing clear favoritism is laughable. Did your sister ever stand up for you? Not that it was her role, but it would have been nice. Her behavior in this situation is really selfish it's about what she wants and what your parents want disregarding what you want once again not the asshole you are not required to do anything period yes they are your parents but it's been clear all your life and not to just you that you were always number two i would not split the costs financially at all if she wants help maybe offer to help set some things up but i don't feel like you need to go all out for people who never did for you not the asshole ask them what they want and do the opposite seriously your sister knows that she will get all of the attention for doing this. All she wants is for you to help to fund her big moment with them. Not the asshole, and I'm surprised you're still keeping in touch with them. You aren't obliged to give your parents anything just because they made you. I hope you are surrounded by better people now. Not the asshole she's the favorite child she doesn't care understand the hurt at all. You shouldn't help with anything that has to do with either of them. You are not doing anything wrong. Don't let her guilt you. Please don't chip in with your sister. She will take all the credit. Your parents will brag it and says it's from your sister. Not the asshole. I think you feel neglected in your childhood and that is a valid feeling. If you don't want to contribute then don't. Not the asshole I wouldn't want to put that much thought and effort into people who seemingly have no interest in me. Also, don't know if it's a British thing but as far as I'm aware kids don't really get involved in parents' anniversaries beyond an acknowledgement with a card and flowers or other smallish token. To me an anniversary is something special between the partners. I get 30 as a milestone but still. Not the asshole honestly I'd go a level of petty and get them something you'd know they don't like and say but I thought this was your favorite kind of thing with a sweet smile. Bonus points if you do it in front of family who would get what you're playing at. Other than that go no contact with your sister and parents it's clear you're not even a thought to them. Not the asshole. She may have this great idea but it's her idea, doesn't make it your responsibility. She doesn't and they don't get to spend your money. Not the asshole your parents sound horrible, I am so sorry. You should not feel guilty not wanting to give back to people with this much disrespect to their own child. And your sister is terribly insensitive as well btw. There is no way you're wrong here. Your parents couldn't even be bothered to know who you are, what your interests are, what food you like. This level of favoritism absolutely sucks. They made literally no effort during your childhood. If your sister wants to throw a party, fine. You do not have to be involved in any way. Not for any reason. It's easy for your sister to say you're wrong because she didn't have to spend her whole life feeling like second best. Not the asshole. Not the asshole, they should be grateful you didn't go and see with all of them. Not the asshole. Just ignore. If the question is raised, tell your gift to them is still talking to them and that's pretty generous. You're not the asshole. But I wonder if they will even notice if you don't show up. Don't do it, your parents do not deserve you and your grandpa knew it. Stay away go low contact from the sister and parents. It's just unforgivable what they have done to you. Sis had a wonderful idea and you really should listen to her. I am publicly shaming our parents and leaving it all on her shoulders. You should absolutely do that. Not the asshole. Nta, they don't deserve anything. Your grandpa sounds like he is awesome. Not the asshole. If I were you I won't even bother with any gifts nor would I bother show up for the party. Not the asshole. 
she told me if I don't help with the party and the gift I am publicly shaming our parents and leaving it all on her shoulders. You are and you are allowed. She wants to celebrate them because they love her and treated her well. She should do it by herself. She told me if I don't help with the party and the gift I am publicly shaming our parents and leaving it all on her shoulders. Perfect. I don't see the problem. Not the asshole. Tell your sister she's on her own and you'll do your own, separate gift. I'm petty, but if it were me, I'd start getting your parents what you want as gifts instead of what they want. When I was growing up, I wanted a horse so badly. I was never entitled enough to ask for one, but it was common knowledge. On my 13th birthday, my mom got me a plastic toy horse, and laughed that now she had gotten me a horse, I should be happy. On my 16th birthday, same thing, my parents got me a model car. The following Christmas, my mom asked for clothes. I got her a Barbie dress. Not the asshole. You owe your family nothing. The good thing is that you can choose your family now. Stay in contact with those who are good to you, leave out the toxic ones, and choose from among your friends a new set of family members to fill in the blanks so to speak. Chosen families are a great gift. Not the asshole and I have a feeling if you did chip and they would only thank your sister for the expensive gift. Not the asshole you should be able to say you're happy for them that they are celebrating an important anniversary, but since you don't have a good relationship with them, you're not interested in being involved in the celebration. If your sister tries again with the guilt trip about helping her, you tell her this isn't a party for her, it's a party for your parents you don't have a good relationship with, so again don't want to be involved. But thanks for thinking of including me. Not the asshole, but if you want to get truly petty and burn all the bridges in a spectacular fire, you could offer to pay for catering G and DJ, then order a menu of entirely your favorite food with not even a nod to theirs and ask the DJ to play exclusively your favorite music with explicit instructions not to play anything they enjoy. Not the asshole. I have similar issues with my sibling who is the golden child your sister, like my sibling is fully aware of the favoritism but ultimately cannot understand your perspective because she never experienced it. She doesn't know what it feels like to know your second best, day in, day out. If she wants to go all out then she can shoulder it. Give grandpa a hug on behalf of this stranger, he's a star. Sorry about the rest of the family though. Not the asshole. Throw your grandpa a party instead on the same day. Not the asshole. If I was up, this would be my villain origin story. Not the asshole publicly shame your parents harder. I don't think this is a big enough slap in the face. Doubt they'd notice anyway though. Not the asshole you parents are the on your sister too for allowing their behavior and actions. The trauma you must have from having to grow up like this is awful. Being a forgotten child is never nice but the fact your parents have been called out multiple times by multiple people and still don't change is awful. If your sister wants to get them the gift your sister should know how to save. Not the asshole they clearly don't care that much about you if they can't even bother to know the very basics about you so why should you care about them? If I were in your shoes, I wouldn't help with the party or the gift, but for any gift giving occasion, I'd start giving them gifts that they absolutely would hate or that only someone else they know like your sister would love and if they called you on it, I'd say it must have just been a mix up. Just like they do. She told me if I don't help with the party and the gift I am publicly shaming our parents and leaving it all on her shoulders. Yes, and? Of course Golden Child loves mom and dad, they never forgot her or what she liked. If she want this party to happen it's on her to do it and hopefully with a little shame thrown their way, your parents will realize the awe they have been to you. Not the asshole. If the party happens either forget to go or bring something they don't like. Just let her do her thing, it's her idea anyway and you never exhibited any interest in helping her. Not the asshole. Not the asshole. She's the offer assuming that you even wag to help. Not the asshole. Well, your parents should be publicly shamed and she should shoulder all the work. She got the benefits of their love and you didn't. And it's not like people don't know how your parents fucked up, no one is gonna call you out if you step back. Please do not ever think that you're enough for not doing what she wants you to do. Let her work hard on something she initially planned without even giving you a clue or heads up about that. She was so wrong for doing that. You're not the asshole. Maybe show your sister this thread? She doesn't really understand how painful it is because it isn't her. These aren't some hypothetical people who just don't know you well the very tough people who are meant to love you more than anyone else ever will abjectly failed to care for you in the same way they did her. Frankly, their indifference to you is appalling and your sister should find some empathy for you before she becomes as bad as your parents. Also, 
your willingness to stay in contact with them at all, shows that you aren't trying to shame them. Reading your post, you know that your parents will give all credit on the party and gifts to your sister, right? So think if you are ready to have another heartbreak at the party, or just let her do the effort by herself. Not the asshole. Not the asshole. You don't owe your parents or your sister anything. At your ages and with other family pointing it out, your sister is well aware of the preferential she received. She's now trying to force shame you into spending time, money and effort on people who didn't bother to do any of that for you. Let her pay for what she wants, you don't have to do anything. Listen to your grandpa and go and see with them. He's the only person who always had your back. If you still want to keep low their anniversary buy a non-personal gift for them if you wish so but cut them out. It will feel hard at first but it's a decision that will help you mentally into your future. Surely not the asshole she should have talked to you first because she sounds like she's holding you at gunpoint to make you help her. Not the asshole. If you did something for her, she'll be even more favored too. Not the asshole. Your last statement says it all. She's just projecting her insecurities and fears if she fails to give them what she envisioned. If being the ah means choosing your happiness which is obviously not helping her in this case well then, you are. Please do things that'll please you and make you happy instead of being set aside once more, up. No. They're all the offer treating you so bad through the years. Not the asshole. Petty me do everything for the party food, gifts, everything but, do all your favorite things, all the gifts you wanted growing up and honor your grandpa in the party. Edit typo. She told me if I don't help with the party and the gift I am publicly shaming our parents and leaving it all on her shoulders. Yes. Exactly. Not the asshole I don't know about that celebration but I wish to see disappointment in everyone's eyes. Not the asshole, I understand why you did nothing, 